light rays coming off the accretion disk bend over the top and end up coming to our telescopes. So what we end up seeing is something that looks like that. Similarly, light from the bottom of the accretion disk comes underneath, gets bent underneath the black hole, and comes towards us like that. And this is where we get an image that looks something like the interstellar black hole. The streams continue to percolate out of the Milky Way's dense gas disk into the galactic halo. Scientists concluded that the black hole clearly surged in brightness as much as one million fold in the last million years. That would be enough for a jet to punch into the halo material whenever that does actually end up happening. It's sure to be quite a spectacular show. The residual jet feature is close enough to the black hole much more prominent.